You're probably clicking on this video thinking, sweet, the fall of winter homes coming. I know what to expect. And then there's me, where I'm clicking fall of winter home and I am anxiety ridden and very stressed because I don't know what we're getting into. Uh, we've built our city to survive the long winter. Now we have to fight against time to save it, to save it and our lives from impending doom. We got a little sneak peek of this at the end of the last video from the end of that scenario of the refugees, which was really hard, by the way. And uh, we just took a look and kind of put some initial no thoughts together. There. Hold on. If anyone... No. That we were here. We did our best. We, the survivors, doomed by our own mistakes. Aware of the risks and the price to pay. We took our last chance. Uh, it's probably foreshadowing, honestly. That's probably the end. <laughs> Buckle up. Buckle up. Our generator's malfunctioning after our leader ignored the problem for weeks. Unbearable cold and brutal repression drove us to rise up against him. He didn't go down without a fight, and half the city was burned to the ground in the fighting. With the generator hastily patched up, your first task as a new leader is to restore Winter Home and convince people it has a future. Then you'll be able to investigate the cause of the generator malfunctions. Okay. So, we have all of these, like, city ruins that we need to clear. I recall that. We have a lot of, like, our population's massive. Uh, we have a bunch of weird placements for tents. It's like, this city was not really designed. It was just... <laughs> it's just here. Our people are suffering this badly planned, starving, half-ruined city. You have to restore their hope and quell their discontent. For a start, remove the charred ruins to show the city's recovering. Our engineers will inspect the generator once you deal with the present crisis. So, pause. Okay. <laughs> this is, like, very overwhelming. Look how many people we have. It's insane. We have some things that are already signed into law here. Nothing in the purpose tree, although that can help us with things like hope and discontent. So that'll be important, I think. Uh, we have cool things like organ transplants available for faster healing because we have a whole bunch of sick people, but I'll probably go into overcrowding first because we just, we need space. Child labor and child labor all jobs is already ticked, which is cool. And it looks like a child designed this layout. <laughs> so maybe shouldn't assign that quite yet, but we'll go radical treatment right off the bat. Okay. Look, we already got some hope, but 79 people have died. Now, couple of things that we're going to do. We're going to dismantle some streets. Um, so, at a glance, this area out here has some workforce stuff going on. Now, this is gathering... Oh. Okay, that is neat. So, these outposts gather from the ruins. So, I don't have to go and do that individually. Uh, we do have hunter's huts, and we are going to need food, so I'm going to employ those. We have two up top, one at the bottom. Okay, fair. Uh, we have medical tents that I'm going to need to staff for sure. One, two, three, four. Okay, so I've got four. Uh, they're probably going to need to be heated. That's fine. What's our generator at? So we have researched up to level three. Let's check in here. So mechanical calculators is unlocked. Generator efficiency stuff. Uh, the beacon, the outpost depots are already underway. And by underway, I mean done. Houses are actually done as well. Hunter's gear here. Uh, hot houses. Medical post upgrade could be really nice. I think this scenario, this makes sense if the gathering posts do actually gather from these things. Faster gathering seems like a fantastic option. Uh, we do also have, like, the coal thumpers. How many of these do we have? Okay. Uh, we'll heat that as well. Just to try to prevent more sicknesses. Here's another gathering post that we can grab. Now, this has no gatherable resources in range, but it will from this. 
The, uh, the cookhouse. I mean, yeah, we'll just put kids there, I think. I'm just trying to fill up our current situation. Uh, we'll put kids there. So there's the two. This place is too chilly. This place, we'll turn that up. Uh, the workshop. So we're going to put engineers there. I think we'll go faster gathering and start that. What is this? Public house is in a really terrible spot. Like, one of the challenges is we're going to need to clear a bunch of this stuff and get the, um, get other things in here. Like, all of these little wooden ruins need to be cleared. Um, let me look at removing some roads. Now, some of these things, like out here... Hold on, let me not get too ahead of myself. We have steelworks. Um, what else do we have? Steam hubs. Do we have any wood being gathered, like, anywhere? Here, yes, yeah, sawmill, okay. Cool. Can put that just on during working hours. This will have to stay on for those tents. Uh, same with this. Public house. I mean, sure. We'll heat that up, too. This can stay on during just working hours, I think. We have uh, a scout team that we could send right off the bat. Which is cool. This can just be working hours, working hours. Okay. So then in here, these are things we're going to want to get rid of, not our stockpiles. Um, but we may actually have to make space. Yeah, we probably have to make space because the gathering posts are going to uh, require that. But that seems like it'll be quite helpful. Okay, let's actually get to removing some, some roads here. Let's go all the way in, like this, all the way in, all of this can be gone, 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 like I don't need, I need these to stay connected I suppose, I don't need any of that, any of this, any of that, okay. This needs to stay, so we just have to keep a connection somewhere. So, like, this is fine. This should stay, I think. Uh, but I probably don't need this. I do need to keep this thing connected. Let's get rid of all of that. Oh, now that's split. Okay, well, not a big deal. We can connect it right there. Okay. Get rid of this. Get rid of that. Okay. What is this actually heating here? Honestly, uh, nothing right now. So I can just turn that off until I get things going out there. That needs a connection. Can remove some of the redundant stuff there. That actually doesn't even gain me anything, I just realized. But I can remove some of these redundant ones. That needs a connection. Actually, it doesn't, because we have a connection from here. All of those need to be connected. Oh, I'm sure this is riveting. I'm sure this is just riveting to watch, too. You guys probably are loving this right now. <laughs> it's gotta be done. Gotta be done. This is all dead space there. That can be turned off. I feel like that's a decent little start. There's probably some optimizations here, but it's not too shabby. Okay, so we've chosen our research, faster gathering. We've chosen our book of laws uh, to get into overcrowding. I've got a million people sick. We've already got some amputees. We don't have any food, but that's going to be fixed relatively soon. Where is that cookhouse? Yeah, so we're heating there and there. That'll get fixed. Um, right off the bat, I do feel like some medical posts would be decent here. This is going to get turned on. 
And that means I can heat over here. That's a lot, but at the same time, we need them. Okay. So I can put engineers in there. Uh, could I build extra factories before I unpause? Or maybe I should go gathering posts. In sp oh, yeah, okay. That's actually a decent call, I think. Try to find any spots that do have space. Like this. And then I'm out. I'm out. Of goodies. Okay, should I unpause? Let's let the mayhem begin. We do have a bunch of extra workers, which is, you know, obviously we want that. And they will help with building. Okay, let's just let it go. We do have some coal coming in. Oh, that's another thing. We can make a... Uh, we can make a scout team. Probably should have done that. Let's cancel this, and let's cancel this, and let's get a scout team, and we'll just start cruising. Okay. Do I have more scouts? I do, so I could actually get two scout teams. Um, okay, let's just let the day begin. Let's put this on just level one. It's only minus 40. And what's this heating? We do have some houses there. That's fine. Um, actually, all of these places in close. This can all just be manually tackled. So that we can start replacing this with housing that people can live in. Right? And I, since I have so many workers and children, why not do this, right? Let's keep going here. Clear out some of that. And then I need some extra resources. Let's get our other thing going once people start working. Get going. Time to earn your bread. So there's my coal thumper. That's up. This coal thumper. People are building. Okay, so they'll hop over there in a sec. I'll heat this as well. There's our engineers. This guy's waiting for a delivery. Okay, so that means I actually need to build storage right off the bat. I'll build it out there. Um, 27 wood. Okay, let's get to our next one. And we can do the scout team. Wait. Can't support another one. Current limit one. Oh yeah, I don't have it. I don't have it unlocked. Okay, it's available. Duh. Alright, that's fine. Let's go uh coal. So now he can deliver that and he can keep going. Storage limit. Oh, storage limits reach for food, too. Okay. Let's do... Man, this is... I feel like this is going to be intense. We'll sync that up. And then when these places get uh, completed, I guess we could get some... Uh, gathering posts in here, right? Okay. I only have four sick. Can I actually build more medical posts? I'm sure that that will not last. And I have engineers, so cool. Uh, what tech do we have unlocked? So we have 
wall drills, we have steelworks, sawmills, and coal mining. Uh, why don't I get the wall drills up and running? Looks like a, it's wall drill. Okay, wall drill, solid. Then we probably need to go like... I don't know. Maybe we're going to need coal. We'll heat this place. Put workers there. Gathering posts. So you can see what's being covered already. We'll connect this one. Frostbite. Okay, good. Steam cores. Yep, fine. We have three left. I have ten workers to go around and build. Okay, help the amputees. I was a field surgeon in the Boer War and worked with this Royal Society to reduce the rate of limb loss. I believe I can devise a method that will cut the number of amputations. Yeah. He won't be able to work. Yeah, that's fine. And hope will rise, which we need. So we need to remove at least 30 ruins. We need to raise hope to 50%, reduce discontent to 25%. Yeah, I mean, seems easy enough, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Uh, let's do some workshops. Building here will destroy resources. Okay, a couple of trees. Let's do that. Okay, engineers. Guess I don't need to heat that right now, actually. Okay, survivors. Uh, the weather stations manned by several engineers use an array of instruments to monitor the air temperature, wind force, and direction, and atmospheric pressure changes. On the basis of this data, they prepare weather forecasts. We could use these engineers in the city to help with the generator, but we close the weather station, we'll lose the weather forecast. It's going to keep getting colder. I can tell you that much. <laughs> uh... So we send them to the city. Weather forecast will no longer be available. It'll take longer to get them there. Scouts will set out towards the city, bring the engineers quickly with them. Or leave the engineers at their post, decide what to do with the engineers later. Um, yeah, I mean, like, it's always going to get colder. This is a, I think this is a bad commitment, especially here. It's always going to get colder, but that's a lot of engineers that could help us with um, healing people. Do we just? Oh God, this is scary. Ooh, I'm gonna I'm gonna send them, and I'm gonna keep going with my uh, scout. Okay. 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 Cool. 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 Okay. This, we can put uh, food rations. I probably also need more food available to come in. We're not for lack of workers, you know what I mean? What is this? Why can't I build this here? Oh, because it's jutting out a bit. Okay. What just popped here? End of weather forecast. Yeah, I'm probably going to regret that. It's going to be one of those things where I'm like not thinking about it, and then the temperature drops, I'm like, right. Now, the good news is when and if that happens, well, it'll happen, uh, we can 
crank this up. But you can see our consumption. That's going to need to be something that we address uh, relatively soon. So we do have coal mining and coal thumpers available. But if I go to steam coal mines, like that's pretty significant. Coal thumpers. Um, we have coal deposits out here. I'm not actually sure what's more efficient. To be honest. Okay, that's all good. These places need builds. Looks like these are going to complete first. Okay. Engineers. Maybe I don't need to run these heaters right now. Okay, this place needs it though. And actually these do too. But you know what? If I'm if I'm going to do this, well, I'll do this for now, okay? But I might as well just build a steam hub here. That'll keep those people a little bit warmer for now as well. Okay. So we do have engineers arriving in 14 hours. So we'll fill those in a bit. Oh, this place needs workers now. And I'll heat that because it's kind of out in the middle of nowhere. Okay, how are things looking? Well, they've been better, but now we can go into overcrowding. I'm actually pretty happy with the way that our medical care is being handled right now. So I've probably maybe overdone it in terms of how many medical tents I built, but not a big deal. I just want to make sure I don't have engineers doing any non-engineer work. I don't. Okay, so now what we'll start doing is we'll pull workers off of these things and fill those hunter huts as they become available. You can see here we're already out of food, so... And then we're going to need another batch. Let's take from here. And would it have been nice to get that up the night before? Yeah, probably. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Um, okay, now. I need to remove people from stuff like this. Put them out here. This snow pit, that's a very bizarre position for it. I'm glad we have it because I can get into faster healing, but yeah. Okay, let's let it fly here. Now, actually, yeah, some of these little places inside still need to be cleared out. I'm okay with these bunk houses. This cookhouse is awkward. I'm gonna get rid of that, actually. The public house as well, quite awkward. I'm gonna get rid of that. Wooden ruins we're working on. The stockpiles, fine. We're working on that. Then we can build around this ring. This workshop probably doesn't need to be there. That could probably get moved. The tent's fine. All of this stuff's getting cleared. These places not being close together, kind of annoying. Might have to fix that. We'll see. Okay. 
So let's take some of this. I'm not going to go into the houses just yet. And I'm also going to try to create some type of normalcy in here. Let's maybe wait for that. This is redundant. We literally only have one connection point here. <laughs> Which is kind of uh, weird. But I can actually get rid of this too. And like so. Okay. Let's let them do that. Okay, what'd you find here? Stone ships. Nothing. Okay, steel bridge, go. I'm I'm a little concerned about this weather station situation. I I am I don't know if that was the right decision. I'll feel better once the engineers get here and I'm like, "Okay, well there's uh stuff for them to do." <laughs> nice. Oh, can we overdrive at night? Yeah, let's do it. Should have done that earlier just to keep people a little roasty. We are in the range level 3. I don't know if I really need that, but Okay, so the sicknesses have piled back up. First amputation. We gotta sign the care house law. I'm not against that, actually. I don't know why I left that so quickly. The care house could be good. It helps with hope. Gets the gravely ill out of the care houses, or out of the um, hospital tents. They eat less. It's not bad, actually. That could be nice, because, like, if you, you, like, look at this. It's insane. It's insane. Okay. Once those start going, I'm going to be very, very, very happy. I should get the public house back up somewhere, I guess. But, like, where? How about here? That's cool for me. Work time. Get moving. I could just start building these in this section, but I kind of want to get a sense of how I'm going to do that from this road. How much, how many empty houses or empty spots do I have for housing? Because I don't want to just demolish things. I got 40 vacant beds. All right. So let me get rid of this. This hunter's hut is in a terrible position. Let's get rid of that. I'll get rid of the fighting arena. And... Maybe even this workshop. The stockpiles stay. These ruins, that's fine. Okay, that does put me a workshop behind. is ugly. Okay, go. A voice in the ruins. We have heard a child's voice coming from the wreckage. A child survived the terrible night of destruction when half of Winterhome burned. So many lives were lost in the blaze, we can't let him die too. Does that mean like... Oh, right here? Okay, cool. Send it. That's exciting. Okay, some of these are getting cleared, like, right now. Let's get at least 10 free just to have uh, some building stuff happen. Okay, yeah, runes are just popping down. Some runes cleared. Hope will rise. Okay, 
I love that. I love that. Good, good. Coal is becoming a problem in terms of space, which is a really nice problem to have. This is very awkward placement, but... That's fine. Storage limits reached here. Okay. So that means we have a gathering post, right? Yes, but it's gathering just a bunch of... It's also gathering all this stuff. So how do I address that? I need to clear some extra things, basically. If I could clear that, it would be sick. We'll keep these guys to build. Survivors reach the city. Good. Is that my engineers? Yes. Okay. Okay. So, fill this. You guys are going to build? Why? How dare you? Fewer amputations. Okay. I'm certainly an or unorthodox method, and my learned colleagues would be appalled at the experiments I had to perform, but it works. I expect the number of amputations during radical treatment to be halved. Hey, sick. Okay. That's great news. That is great news. I have so many free workers. Uh, steel. Steel is a problem. Steel is a problem. Steel's a problem. Uh, I got steelworks. Oh, okay. So I have to clear that. Public house, sure. Um, are there any other steel locations? No. Okay, so that needs to be a priority clear for me. Put some kids out there. Um, we have all these extra workers. So I'm going to start trying to clear some of this other stuff. And maybe I can build another workshop. I'm sure they love going that far for work, but I mean... We got bigger problems. This is the place with the kids, right? Resting after the hunt? Okay, let's dismiss all of these. Let's actually just mark all, dismiss, general. Well, let me throw engineers there, because they're actually not busy. Faster gathering. Going to eat, steel bridge. Sick! Uh, okay, what else is happening here? Cut off any outposts further down this route. Scouts will still be able to cross the bridge. Oh, man. I'm going to take the immediate... I'm going to take the immediate... Um, iron deposits. Okay, that's probably iron, de iron deliveries then. God. Let's go check it out. I'm going to take the automaton, though. I feel like that's pretty massive. We can just put them at steel or wood or whatever we want. Um, Tense-wise? Let's get this going. That's a little bit awkward. I kind of want to wait until we have the nice spacing available. I think that's fine. Then I would do one here. Spacing's weird. So if I went like this, then I go one, two, three. So I would do one like here. I can live with that. Okay. Okay. 
Research wise, what are we picking? What are we picking? How's my food? It's okay. I'm actually thinking maybe I go medical post upgrades here and we get some just faster healing around the clock. Okay, go. Uh, where did I put those engineers? I put them here, right? Clear that up, put the workers in. Make sure that all of these places have engineers at them. Medical post there. Now, I do have some extra engineers. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. We're going to build medical posts. Okay. Hey, nice. That's actually great. Tents there. Did we find that kid yet? They're all building. It's interesting how they prioritize that. Generator. Let's turn that off for a bit. I probably should have only been running that at night, but whatever. Uh, let's go coal here to make sure we can keep getting our coal deliveries. Here's another workshop. Here we go. And what we'll do is um, we'll just take a couple out of here and kind of balance it. I don't know if maybe it would make sense to have them more scattered around for travel time and stuff. I'm, I'm not sure the impact of that, to be honest. <sighs> okay, guys, we are, we, are, we are in it right now. We are in it. It's happening. Feels pretty decent, believe it or not. Um, what's the next thing we need to tackle? Clearly food is an issue. I might need to get into, like, hunter's tactics or hot, uh, maybe even flying hunters because these cost steam cores and I only have three at the moment. <sighs> so that feels a little bit bad. Maybe I could do some extra hunter huts. Like that. Okay, tell you what, let's take a break here. When we come back, we're gonna pick up from this location and uh, <laughs> we just mean luck because I don't know. I, I've, the thing is when you do these runs for the first time, you don't know how to gauge if you're anywhere near what you need to be doing. Like I have no clue. We're only on day two, but I mean, a lot of our time has been spent paused, which is, um, you know, unfortunate, but true. Oh, yeah, these places, I'm, like, overheating. And we don't need that because we have the, uh... Yeah. Okay. That's fine. Now, coal, as the temperature drops, I'm going to need to increase that. I feel like I'm not gathering enough coal currently. This place hasn't gotten stopped, as far as I know. And, okay, yeah, this place is only gathering from there. So, I guess I could maybe do another gathering post here. And then what that will do is gather from there, and it'll knock down these steel ruins, which is great. So, yeah. Okay, I'm going to pause. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you next time. Bye for now.